As a way of battling the incessant increase in the cost of feed production, protein farmers or experts have embarked aggressively in studying the usage of natural growth promoters which are sustainable, palatable, and how you and I as a protein farmer can take advantage of this effectively in improving the growth performance of our chickens. So on today's video, I'll bring to you yet another super natural growth promoter for your chicken which is known as the Moringa leaf. So I'll be sharing with you when you should start using this leaf for your chicken, the head benefit to your chicken and the inclusion rate in general. So stay tuned, I will write back. My name is Ezra Kosama from PoultryFarmGuide.com. On this channel, I share helpful tips and guides to enable you to set up your poultry farming business and scale it up. So welcome back. As I said earlier, I'm going to share with you how to use Moringa leaf for your chicken, the head benefits, how to prepare Moringa leaf extract and the inclusion rate in general. It is not surprising that many farmers around the world now use Moringa leaf as an alternative feed ingredient. No wonder many of them refer to it as super food for birds. It has been reported that that leaf has been used to treat gastrointestinal, vas uh, cardiovascular, and hematological disorder both in human and in livestock. Now, what are the health benefits of Moringa leaf for your chicken? Moringa leaf, just as every other plant extract, contains some bioactive ingredients that contains vitamin, amino acid, and mineral, which is very essential in growth performance of chickens in general. Apart from that, Moringa leaf contains high crude protein and all essential amino acids. Moringa leaf improves the feather color of chicken. Birds that is feeding on Moringa leaves are resistant to diseases because it boosts the immune system of the chicken. It contains also antimicrobial agents which can help the chicken to fight against infectious diseases. Moringa leaf also increases the yolk and shear quality of your hands. So there are so many health benefits of Moringa leaf extract in general. I cannot emphasize all of them yet. So how do you prepare Moringa leaf extract for your chicken? You get the you sun dry, you don't you put it under a shade, you don't sun dry, you air dry. You can put it in a room where air can blow over it, or you put it under a shade. After drying it in that manner, then you grind to powder. After grinding it, then you can include it while formulating your chicken feed. They have so many from research, there are so many inclusion rates which have been ported to be effective, but the 10% inclusion rate is more consistent with results. So while using it, in permitting your feed, you can include for 25 kg bag of feed, you can include 2.5 kg of moringa leaf extract or meal to your feed. Then for 70 kg bag of feed, 7% of moringa leaf meal to your chicken feed. Then for 100 kg bag of feed, you put 10 kg of moringa leaf meal to the feed. Now, some people will ask me, when can they start using this? leave me this moringa leave me for their chicken they old is okay you provided you are putting it in their feed you can start using it at day old day old chicks in the feed why for water you can start using it after two weeks they have more reaction when you start using this uh, leave me in their in water so they have more they they have they they, they can it can repair them from drinking that water the smell no you can repair them from drinking the water so it is better you start using it after two weeks or one week it is okay okay then for feed from Day old misses with their feet and start using it from day old. Now there are some questions people may ask: Can they put it in already made feed? Yes, you can put it in already made feed or already formulated feed. But you can only have the nutritional value and the medicinal value. You cannot have the advantage of uh, reducing the feed cost. The feed is already complete, and because why it is good to use this me this moringa leaf me extract and other leaf me extracts in permitting feed is to reduce one advantage is to reduce feed cost so once you buy a commercial feed and include it in it it's good you can only have the medicinal and the nutritional advantage there but the advantage of reducing your feed cost will not be there again but once you include this thing at the beginning of formulating your feed you can as well reduce soya beans maize other feed stock to an appreciable level then use this leave me extract or moringa leave me extract to substitute for that for those feed stock in that way you have reduced your cost of uh, feed production but if you include it 
in a commercial feed which is already complete in general you're only getting the medicinal or nutritional value so i hope i'm clear in this aspect if you want to learn how to use a uh, purple leaf mango leaf and uh, aloe vera for your chicken please i'll leave the link in my description below or visit or just check the above link and choose any of the video which interests you see you on my next video as you click bye bye